Hey Star Wars fans and action figure collectors, welcome back to another review. We're jumping straight back into some more of the uh, Clone Wars Black Series. We're going to be rounding out these bunch of reviews, these four figures. Uh, did Anakin last week, but we're going to start by kicking off uh, with Obi-Wan. And we'll get through the rest in the next couple of days, so stay tuned uh, to the channel. So yeah, we're looking at Obi-Wan Kenobi. Really, really excited with this one. The Anakin figure is just... So good. Um, so yeah, really looking forward to uh, cracking this guy open. Um, yeah, love the packaging, like I said with the Anakin video. Um, yeah, really, really excited to get this Obi-Wan out. Being a diehard Clone Wars fan that I am, you know, these figures are beyond exciting. I really hope they've got plans to do more, not necessarily in this packaging, but um, wouldn't object to it, to be honest. <laughs> Um, but yeah, more, more characters from the Clone Wars, uh, Season 1 Ahsoka to go with these two would be fantastic. Um, but yeah, stay tuned to my channel in the next couple of days. I'm going to be doing, uh, reviews on Clone Pilot Hawk and of course Arc Trooper Echo as well. So, without further ado, let's open up Obi-Wan Kenobi and take a look. Alright, here is General Kenobi out of his packaging and this figure is absolutely excellent. Um, as you can see... Just behind, I have Anakin fighting, dueling with Asajj Ventress, and I just, I'm so excited to add Obi-Wan to this scene, and just tweak Ventress a little bit so she can be fighting both of them. Um, yeah, absolutely remarkable figure. This is easily my favourite Obi-Wan to date. Um, Re Revenge of the Sith Obi-Wan definitely deserves this kind of quality, in my opinion. Um, head sculpt-wise just perfect you know that is absolutely remarkable i think it's even better than the uh, previous one that came on the the other clone wars obi-wan the sort of super armored one this is even better i love this absolutely fantastic i've absolutely nailed that in my opinion and as per my what I did with my Anakin review, as I showed the original version. So here is the original animated version from 2008. So yeah, they've really, really captured it well. Um, yes, I still really like these old Clone Wars figures. I think Clone Wars is just some of the best, best stuff out there, <laughs> in my opinion. Um, so yeah, I'll put him aside, because this is the figure we're talking about. Um, so yeah, reusing arms from the new updated sculpt of the Clone Troopers. So he has the pinless joints in the arms, which is absolutely fantastic. He has the Jedi symbol there, printed on the shoulder bell. Uh, lower legs are from the Clone Trooper, and he has new upper legs. So yeah, got the pinless joints, which is fantastic. And yeah, probably just, it could be reused. I I'm not recognizing where that's from. So um, yeah, we're gonna go and say they're new to this figure. So um, now the upper torso is just a sort of pretty standard black sort of shirt. And this sort of extra tunic, the armor is sort of just a one molded piece, soft plastic. So you can allow for articulation when the arms come forward. Um, but yeah, that's just put over the top of the uh, base of the figure, much like the Anakin. So, works well. I think it looks good. Um, I'm actually going to quickly look. And uh, I was just going to see if it is the same sculpt, but it looks to be slightly different. Again, I could be wrong. There's different creases and stuff in the fabric. So, yeah, it's unique to Obi-Wan, which is cool. And he comes with his lightsaber as well, which I'm not going to unpeg it, just because they do tend to break sometimes. So, but it does peg into his belt there, so that's fantastic. Absolutely amazing, love it, love, love, love this figure. But yeah, articulation's fantastic. Yeah, great elbow movement. It's got the uh, butterfly joints in the uh, shoulders as well, so you can move those arms sort of back and forward. You can sort of rock them at the shoulder. 
so awesome double joint in the necks and get them to look way up and down. Fantastic. Love the details. I love this outfit. I thought it was strange that they gave us the uh, Obi-Wan before, and I do love that figure, but um, yeah, I always would have preferred this one. But it's cool. We can have a nice sort of, you know, before and after, if you want to class the uh, Tartakovsky Obi-Wan as canonical. But that's that's personal preference. But yeah, I'm, I really, really love this. I'd love to get a uh, Phase 1 Rex and Cody. I think that would be absolutely awesome. Some more Clone Wars figures. And yeah, Ahsoka season, early season Ahsoka to go with these would be fantastic as well. But yeah, I'd love to hear your thoughts. Please drop them in the comments below. I'm... Yeah, really, really stoked on this Obi-Wan. He looks fantastic. Both him and Anakin look great. Um, yeah, absolutely amazing. So if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. That would be the best. And uh, you can consider becoming a member for a very, very, very small monthly fee. And uh, get some cool perks. A little bit of behind the scenes sort of stuff that I little extra videos I do every now and then. I'm trying to do more. But yeah, if you haven't subscribed to my channel yet, please do. And again, drop a comment below and let me know what you think. Appreciate you watching. Until my next video, may the force be with you always.